What's funny is I was just actually playing Marble Madness the other day, and I was able to beat it. Um, it's a rough game on your hands. Other rough games on your hands. Um, let's talk about that subject, actually. Games that are rough on your hands. Okay. Marble Madness, for sure, for NES. The arcade game's not bad, because the arcade game has the um, trackball, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a trackball mouse so that I can do arcade games. So it might not be the end of Marble Madness. Thanks, uh, Xwani, for subbing. So, other games that are tough on your hands. Mario Party 1. Um, I guess any of the Mario Parties, but Mario Party 1, like the N64 ones, you know, doing that thing with your hand. Um, Mario Party 1, definitely a rough game on your hands. Um, what do you guys got? Rough games on your hands. Centipede says Darth Torgo. Yeah, another person said um, Mario Party. Track and Field. Yeah, track and Field, that's a good one. You know what one's rough? Um, if, you, uh, if you play Double Dare, the very end, the... Um, uh, not the physical challenge, but the, the final obstacle course at the very end. You, you have to do a lot of this tapping on the D-pad. It's ridiculous. Um, Beat-em-ups can hurt your hand after a while, um, for sure. Uh, another person says joust. Um, High-level competitive gaming is rough on the hands. Okay. Fighting games. Sure. Let's see. I had thought of another one. Um... That was really rough on my hands. Uh, oh, I know. Contra 3 on Super Nintendo. So the rocking around of the D-pad um, in that game and just how hard I hit the buttons. And there's that one level, it might be like level 5 or something, it's in the overhead perspective where everything's like spinning, sort of like the whirlpool things. Oh my god. Contra 3. You want a game that'll hurt your hands? Contra 3. Shooters hurt for you. Anticipation. <laughs> Carter says Ghostbusters NES without Turbo. Do I guess doing the staircase? The da, 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 yeah, I can see that. Maybe maybe a little Silver Surfer. I don't think that game hurts so much as it's just annoying to keep like tapping. Um, another person said uh, the the NES Ghostbusters. When I play Grant to Rizmo on PlayStation, my thumb hurts after a while. Oh, yeah. Um, anybody else? Anybody else got any? Games that hurt your hands. We'll get back to the Marble. Uh, I was going to say Marble Madness. Marble it up in a minute. Akari Warriors? Um, I don't know. I don't think Akari Warriors. <laughs> the Rocketeer on Super Nintendo. Uh, not really. Uh, oh yeah, there you go. Rock Band or Guitar Hero. A lot of people say Rock Band or Guitar Hero um, will hurt your hands a lot. Um, some of the mini games of Mario Party. Well, I had mentioned Mario Party One, but really, exactly, certain mini games in any of the Mario Parties will hurt your hand. Um, Virtual, Virtual Fighter 4. See, I don't know much, as much about fighting games, but I'm sure there's a lot of fighting games that'll hurt your hands. Anyway, that's a little subject for you guys. Video games that hurt your hands, let me know. Somebody said Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt? Really? Well, you know what? I don't think that it hurts your hands. That's more like you gotta hold your arm up and like look through the scope on the gun. So I would say more like it's hard to keep your arm up than it hurts your hands. For me, texting hurts after a while. <laughs> Why, thank you, squirrel. Um, somebody says Streets of Rage. Metroid Return of Samus on 3DS hurt your hands. Okay, all right, anyway, so uh, on and on that list can go, but let me know, games that hurt your hands. The one, the Monkey Ball bl Banana Blitz on Wii fucking sucks ass. Oh, there you go. Speaking of games that hurt your hands. Oh my god. Monkey Ball Banana Blitz. I'll fucking explain this again. So Monkey Ball Banana Blitz is like, is the fucking worst. Because, mo okay, Super Monkey Ball. I mean, this controller is sort of similar because it's got the two, like, control sticks. Mon Super Monkey Ball, you know, you're playing like this. Kind of like this game. 
and you're, go you're going around, whatever, and it it's great. You can sit there and play it forever. Banana Blitz, you have the fucking Wiimote, and, like, you see how this game is. To turn, like, left, you go like this with the Wiimote. To turn right, you go like this. You know how much that fucking hurt your... It already hurts my wrist. You know how much that fucking hurts your wrist to be going like that and really like precision and hold it? And also holding your hand up at the fucking... It is the worst fucking game and kills your fucking hands. That, that is the worst piece of shit game. 